So I was 16, so I guess I was a junior. And uh, I, would, I, was in a, I went to school in a military academy outside of Chicago. This was not only a military academy, it was a Catholic military academy. And the priests, like many Catholics, were very excited that Kennedy had been elected since he was, of course, our first Catholic president. And in those days, of course, we didn't have TVs all over the place so that you instantly knew what was going on. But the word, of course, quickly came that uh, the president had been shot. And the priests were devastated. And I remember we were all supposed to get down on our knees and pray. Even I did it, even though I was a non-Catholic. I, I don't consider myself having been that political at the time. But, of course, I, I cared the president was shot. My parents were Republicans. Um, I was always, even at that age, more liberal than they were. Of course, I've become a diehard Democrat since. But uh, for me, the issue wasn't a political issue so much as just the tragedy of it all. All anniversaries are contrived. If we had a different calendar, we would be celebrating this at, or remembering this at a different time. But I think it's a remembrance of a tragic moment in history that unfortunately is, wasn't the first time it occurred and not the last. It is interesting we don't sit around and remember McKinley's, the assassination of McKinley's uh, as president. But of course we don't because um, nobody, nobody who's alive today was alive then. So for, the, for us, the Kennedy story is one that for many people is still fresh. And so even somebody who's younger had parents who remembered the event.